Gynecologic Hemorrhage, Wikipedia Audio Gynecologic hemorrhage represents excessive bleeding of the female reproductive system. Such bleeding could be visible or external, namely bleeding from the vagina, or it could be internal into the pelvic cavity or form a hematoma. Normal menstruation is not considered a gynecologic hemorrhage, as it is not excessive. Hemorrhage associated with a pregnant state or during delivery is an obstetrical hemorrhage. Menstruation occurs typically monthly, lasts 3-7 days, and involves up to 80 ml blood. Bleeding in excess of this norm in a non-pregnant woman constitutes gynecologic hemorrhage. In addition, early pregnancy bleeding has sometimes been included as gynecologic hemorrhage, namely bleeding from a miscarriage or an ectopic pregnancy, while it actually represents obstetrical bleeding. However, from a practical view, early pregnancy bleeding is usually handled like a gynecological hemorrhage. Causes of gynecologic bleeding include Definition Anovulation is a common cause of gynecological hemorrhage. Under the influence of estrogen the endometrium is stimulated and eventually such lining will be shed off. The anovulation chapter discusses its multiple possible causes. Long-standing anovulation can also lead to endometrial hyperplasia and facilitate the development of endometrial cancer. Women with a bleeding disorder may be prone to more excessive bleeding. A hematologic workup should discover the cause. On occasion an ovarian cyst can rupture and give rise to internal hemorrhage. This may occur during ovulation or as a result of endometriosis. If the pregnancy test is positive, consider pregnancy-related bleeding, including miscarriage and ectopic pregnancy. A history will establish if the condition is acute or chronic, and if external circumstances are involved. A gynecologic examination is usually complemented by a gynecologic ultrasonography. A blood count determines the degree of anemia and may point out bleeding problems. The pregnancy test is important, particularly as bleeding in early pregnancy presents as gynecological hemorrhage and ectopic pregnancy can be fatal. Diagnosis is broadly classified into supportive and definitive investigations. Gynecologic hemorrhage needs to be evaluated as soon as possible by a physician. The amount and duration of bleeding will dictate whether a bleeding event is an emergency event. Treatment depends on diagnosis and may include hormonal therapy, four fluids, blood transfusion, and slash or a dilation and curatage. Internal bleeding requires laparoscopy or abdominal surgery, in rare and extreme cases a hysterectomy is performed. Types Causes Hormonal Neoplasm Trauma Bleeding disorder Other Diagnosis Supportive Definitive First aid Clinical treatment <laughs>